Here's Osea Bakatalasau. Brings Ma away on the broadcast side with Sunny Isa coming close. And Isa toes it out of play for a throw in. Osea throws it in field. Takiata stopping it. Plays it short to Marika Mandingi. They play it across field. Suba's got the stretch. They're being stretched across as Meli Dondro plays a long through pass. Finds Tuimasi Manuda and a hospital pass by Tuimasi. Taken well by Semi Rokongida on that far touchline side. Rokongida infield to Kotonga. Somewhere La Kotonga pulls it back in. Still Kotonga turns and plays a quick one. Stopped there by uh, Tony Vesakula. Vesakula, Johnny Vesakula to Abu Zaid. Zaid on the broadcast side, turns and plays a quick one, finds her Peter Hills. Hills on the broadcast touchline side. Peter Hills comes in with a cross, headed away again by Simeone Michele. On cleared away by Joshua Wilson. Back up towards the halfway mark, headed back by uh, Kotonga. Leonen Damudamu, super tidied it up, on, on towards the broadcast side, finding again in field, Samuel Adundru for Sunny Isa, chasing for it is Osea Vakatalasau with Sunny Isa, they shield as it comes out of play for a throw in, Osea quickly takes the throw, quick throw, finding Roniel, Roniel flicks it into the center circle area, out across on towards that far touchline side, Meli Dondro switches from Imata to Umata and a bit too far for Abu Zaid to run. The ball beats him out of play as Yogen, the coach, telling them to keep it on the ground. Telling Meli. From the broadcast side, referee has pulled something back. As we've gone now 32 minutes, our broadcast coming to you with the compliments of Vinod Patel. Complete home and building, as the new slogan says, and the spin and win at all the outlets. Ten winners every week, one at each from the outlet. <coughs> Christmas, that's given the toys that they're doing from their side as we pick up play now on the broadcast side. Osea Vakatalasau, his kick. Roniel controls it, it spins away, still Osea. And Joshua Wilson brings down Timasi Manuda for a free kick. <coughs> free kick from the broadcast touchline side. 33 minutes gone in this Pele Garments champion versus champion series here. Baniel Subaniel. They played in the last in the IDC final. And Bar make a change. Malakai Tiwa to come into the field. Peter Hughes goes off. So Peter Hughes having a lot of miss today. And they brought the skills of Malakai Tiwa. We're gonna push Abu Zaid into the striker's position with Twi Masi. And Malakai Tiwa coming back. Remember, Bar play the old league this season. As Osea Vakatalasau floats it high. Simeone Michele with a header. Vesukula. Again, Vesukula short to Avenes. And Avenes finds Meli Dondro. They switch it across field. Waisake Navuninga South. Still Meli Dondro hustling away. Back again in the way. Roniel. Tiri is his little nickname, it is. Uh, Roniel turns away beautifully, does it, drives, it comes into the box, but picked up quickly uh, by Rangata. Emori Rangata with a long kick, not a good one. Marika Mandingi not able to control it. Samuel Adundu races away for the super side, and uh, Marika times his uh, sliding tackle well. Kicks it out of play for a uh, corner kick to uh, the super side to be taken from that far touchline side. So one change already in this game. Two yellow cards, so to say, but no score. 34 and a half minutes of play gone. Sunny Isa to take the corner kick from that far touchline side. Floats a long one. Drundru with a header. Comes on for Kotonga. And Kotonga slams it over the crossbar. Out of play it goes for a uh, goal kick to the bar side. That was a great chance for the super side, which they didn't capitalize on. And Rolulu placing it for himself to take on the right-hand side of the six-yard box. Left of the TV screen. 
Rololo. A long driving one, shoving there by Sammy Rokongi, that referee picking it up well. Andrew Achari, as Ba quickly take the free kick. Tuimasi Manuda, to Malakai Tiwa, covering as Simeone Michaeli, covers for the super side, kicks it out of play. No, it doesn't quite go out of play. Meli Dondro keeps it into the field of play. Infield again, Marika finding... Uh, Malakai Tiwa again to Meli Dondro. Mary squares it infield, finding Ronil. Ronil out to the further outfield to Avines Swami. Avines again, learning again, lays it back. Across on towards that far side to Imasi Manuda for the bar side. Floats it long, looking for Malakai Tiwa, headed away by Samuel Avula. In the way, Semi Rokongida. And Semi heads it out of play for a corner kick to the bar side. Meli Dondro to take the corner kick from that far touchline side. Headed away by Leon and Damundamu. Roniel controls and plays it on for Vesakula. Still bar inside. Vesakula drives a low one across it goes and cleared away by Waisake Nabuninga Sao. Jonas Nadeva chases for it as Marika Mandingi watches it go out of play. Quickly takes the throw. Infield to Takiata. Takiata further to Avanes Swami. Avanes switches a good switch it is to finding Osea. Osea on the broadcast touchline side comes in with a low cross cleared away by Simeone Michaeli. Again reading it well. In comes Ronil with a shot and over the crossbar it goes for a uh, goal kick to the uh, super side. 37 minutes of play gone. Although Bar have had the territorial advantage, they haven't got where it matters. The uh, scoreline still nil all. And Simeone Michele to take the kick. Hi, Sunny Isa nodding it on. Takiata playing it back. Remember in the second half, Bar will defend with the breeze. At the moment, it's over as Malakai Tiwa turns, lines up his shot from a bit too far. Trying to get his engine rolling, Malakai Tiwa. Trying to have an attempt to get some confidence, but that didn't come with that shot as Emori Rangata driving a long one Takiata with a header and out comes Rolulu and again on the short broadcast side Osea Vakatala Sao a handball by Samu Kautonga <coughs> and it'll be a free kick to uh, the bar side quickly taken by bar across Leon and Damundamu covering in miss uh, miss cue by Simeone Michaeli finding Malakai Tiwa Tiwa inside the box what does it go out of play for a corner kick to be taken on the broadcast touchline side Tiwa takes the short one to Osea Osea from the inside on the broadcast touchline side squares it in field to Avenes Avanes pulls it, still Avanes Warren Swami gets up again, Avanes turns, pulls it away, but couldn't get his final pass away as Rokongida was in the way. Suba bring it away on the broadcast touchline side. Sunny Isa turns away from Vesukula, lovely skills by him, but in the way Takiata. Takiata turns and clears it away. Referee warning Sunny Isa for that late challenge as Roniel plays a quick one away from Joshua Wilson. On to Osea Vakatalasau, Vakatalasau one for Tuimasi. And Tuimasi just places it into the hands of Emori Rangata. Rangata races out with confidence. Then he comes in with a long driving kick. Ralulu comes in with a big header and he heads it out, out of play on that far side. But Tuimasi Manuda, that miss. He had the golden chance for the bar side, but straight into the hands of Rangada. So Lady Luck still on super side in this game so far. Throw in from that far touchline side. Mba on to Malakai Tiwa. Tiwa plays a through pass to Imasi Manuda again. And to Imasi smacks it and following through Abu Zaid. Another miss as Rangata placed it into the path of Abu Zaid. And Abu Zaid kicks it out of play. Another easy miss for the bar side. Well, how can you describe it really sitting here with us, the engineer? Barasuba looking a bit tired in this heat again. And you can sympathize with them because quite a few of these players haven't been training. 
As the referee goes across to have a look at Simeon and Mike Kelly. Has, uh, hasn't been training because when you know the <coughs> traditional ob obligations and there's a death, but it is Semi Rokungida. Now Simeon and Mike Kelly it is. He gets up, needs that uh, bit of uh, magic sponge. Rangata wanting water. So they got the second half, remember? That's going to be a crucial and interesting second half. 41 minutes gone. 41 minutes of play. Subab held on to Bar. Subanil, Barnil. And uh, Simeone, so they will have to take the uh, kick. Waisake Nabuningasau to take the kick, the goal scorer. In that IDC final, credited to him. And when we talk about goal line technology, they are testing it out in Tokyo in the World Club Championship, which Auckland City are out of as winners of the O League. As we pick up play now on the GAN, in by Tuimasi Manuda. Tuimasi back to Roniel. Roniel again, a lovely play with uh, Tiwa. Roniel turns and drives, and it comes off uh, Simeone Michaeli. Michaeli has been a stonewall for uh, the super side, although he hasn't trained much, but he certainly has been a stonewall for the super side here this afternoon. And Rangata, of course, you've got to give him credit too. They wouldn't think that they haven't been training. The kick to come from the broadcast touchline side. Referee talking to the linesman having a discussion maybe wanting some shade also at the same time <laughs> so Meli Dondro to take the corner kick from the broadcast touchline side and in comes the kick a deep one it is too looking for Tiwa Tiwa with the header with the Leon and Damun Damun and out of play it goes well a lot of bar fans still drinking the Anna of uh, the uh, Tata's uh, our friend Tata from Tata's rental car and uh, Dominion <laughs> uh, all enjoying and supporting bar and uh, well what a place to drink also we eh? at uh, Denorau enjoying lovely beer well certainly would be lovely in this conditions here as we pick up play on that far touchline side, again back in fight, Meili Dondro, 43 minutes of play gone. And as Meili plays it, they gets the one, two, Meili races away on that far touchline side into the Super Bowl. And he comes with a chip kick on for Tuimasi, uh, Abu Zaid and Zaid's header comes off Semi Rokongida for another corner kick to uh, the Mba side. As 43 minutes of play gone, Barnil, Souvenir, our broadcast coming to you with the compliments of Vinod Patel, biggest name, uh, rather complete home and building. And they've got their spin and win for this Christmas promotion as in comes the kick. And Osea turns and plays along a bit bit one, high one, Imata to Mata, to Imasi, in the way, lovely play that time by Avinash Swami, he's playing well for the uh, bar side, Malakai Tiwa in the way also, and then cleared away by Kotonga, a long clearance, Super come in with a counter attack, as Samuel Andrundru races away on the broadcast touchline side, still Samuel Andrundru in the way, Takiata. <coughs> Rundru looks for support, gets the support of Samuel Avula. Vula switches from a deep one from Imata to Imata. Jonas Nadeba with a header. In they come once again, and the kick by Kotonga, a bit too high off the head, uh, forehead of Ronil. It'll be a free kick. 44 minutes gone. Huh? Time looming on our clock. <coughs> Quickly taken by Rolulu. To Mandingi. Avines Swami into the Suba territory that they come on that far side. Avines floats it along but caught well again by Rangata. So these two have kept uh, Simeone and Rangata have kept the Suba side in the game. Vesakula covers with a header. Backheads it on the second time. Roniel kills it down. Roniel bringing the bar side away on towards the broadcast infield. Finding to Imasi Manuda. Touches it on for Tiwa. Tiwa switches across field. To Avinas Swami, Swami quickly on to Meli Dondro. Dondro on that far touchline side. Infield turns still Meli Dondro. Dondro turns and drives and he smacks it across, as I said. Shelf is, uh, shelf is play, but it got a fingertip to uh, Aimori Rangata. So it'll be a corner kick to be taken from the broadcast touchline side. 
another attempt by Ba, blocked by Rangata. And as the kick comes from, to come from the broadcast touchline side, Ronil Kumar with to take the kick. Ronil drives a low one, the header through by Osea, and out of play it goes as play gone now. 46 minutes, 46 minutes of play, half time looming on our clock. Simeone Michele on the left hand side comes up with a kick. Kotonga heading it down, not good though. Roni uh, on the way, Tiri. Tiri pulls it away from Sunny Isa. Plays the short one to Abu Zaid. Zaid get, uh, collides uh, with uh, Joshua Wilson and will be a free kick. And Joshua slams, uh, pushes the head of Abu Zaid. And that's not counted for. And let's see what he does. It was well off the ball, not counted for. That's manhandling. No card by uh, Andrew Achari. He actually pushed his head, and that's manhandling in the uh, process of the refereeing. And is allowed the benefit of doubt. As I say, they're the ones that make the decision. As in, they come once again with the kick on that far touchline side. <laughs> and that far side again, Meli Dondro gets shoved out of the way, but they say play on. Join us in the, uh, that uh, got it away, then cleared away by Suba. Takiata chesting it down. Cross on to Marika Mandingi. 47 minutes gone, two minutes into at a time. Ronil infield. Ronil gets another through pass, finds to Imasi Manuda. Manuda controls it down, plays it on for Seb Vakatalasau. Vakatalasau floats it into the box. Tiwa climbs high, but no header. Abu Zaid keeps it in. Abu from that far touchline side floats another long one looking for Tuimasi. No power at all in the header by Tuimasi. And out of play it goes for a uh, goal kick to the super side. 48 minutes gone. Three minutes of at a time. As they do so, the referee points to the center spot here. It's half time here at Lotoka's Turtle, <coughs> Turtle Park in the Pele Garments Champion versus Champion Series. And at the half time mark, Mbanil Subanil. Ready to kick off now. Abu Zaid to Masi. And across on towards the far side. Osea Bakatalasau. Infield again onto <coughs> to Marika Mandingi. Mandingi short, finds uh, Meli Dondro. Dondro back to Mandingi. Inside on the broadcast side, Roniel. He gets pushed out of the way by Samuela Kotonga. Referee says play on as they play a long one looking for uh, Samuela Dondro. Picked up by Ralulu though. Ralulu rolls it on for Vesukula. Vesukula for the bar side. Into the super territory he comes. Still again, Vesukula a through pass finding and flick through looking away again on that far side to Abu Zaid. But Suba combined to clear it away. Their defense did well. Samuel Lin and Damundamu, Joshua will misunderstanding and then finally Simeone Michele headed down by Vesukula but it's still Suba Samuel Avula for the Suba side from that far touchline side Malakai Tiwa shadowing him he overruns the ball there'll be a throw in to the bar side Tiwa with a throw looking for Osea Bakatalasau Bakatalasau from the far touchline side floats out deep looking cross from Imata to Umata out on towards the broadcast touchline side and they come once again to Imasi slams it out of play for a throw in to the super side a defensive one it'll be near the corner flag on the broadcast side a short one Semi Rokongida clearing it away Back into the center circle, Sunny Isa with a header, gets it on for Samuel Adrundru. Adrundru turns and drives as he saw Ralulu off his uh, line. And he drove it well and truly over the crossbar as Bauer were outnumbered in attack that time. Attack for the suicide, rather. As Johnny Ralulu places it for himself to take. The second ball in the field. They'll kick it out, and Ba will play with the assistance of a slight breeze. Johnny Ralulu 
Floats it long across, finds Osea Vakatalasau. Vakatalasau from that far touch line side, plays it in, feel a lovely little pass there, finds Roniel. Roniel squares it in for Malakai Tiwa. And Tiwa shot sails over the crossbar as he laid it on for Malakai Tiwa, looking quickly into attack. And on the top next show, As Indra Singh has just given us some information that we will be doing the league games a bit differently, the local soccer this season, compared to the past years. And one of the things that we do have is our uh, car, the truck, isn't it? As uh, Suba come into attack on the far touchline side. On the buzz. Obi Buzz. Our cameraman gives us a good smile, Michael, and gives us a good picture also. A free kick to the super side. Sunny Issa to take the kick from that far touchline side. Inside the bar territory, floats it long and high. Ralulu takes it well. Ralulu up to the edge of his box. Drives and a long one it is too, waiting for it to Imasi. They collide with Simeone, but it comes kindly for Suba. Semi Rokongi that turns and clears it out of play for a throw in on the broadcast side. Play centered. Short throw infield for Takiata. Takiata further infield, finding uh, Johnny Vesakula. Vesakula. Then out on towards the broadcast side. Meli Dondro making Waisake run a bit, but he overruns the ball himself. Short throw to be taken by Waisake in a winning Gasau. On by Jonas Nadeva. Chested out again by Meli Dondro. Referee saying it's a handball by Meli Dondro, so it'll be a free kick. Free kick to the uh, super side. Simeone Michele to take the kick. Floating it high. Across comes Osea Vakatalasau. Heads it down though as Bar look to bring it away from that far touchline side. Avinash Swami infield. Osea Vakatalasau leaves it on for uh, Malakai Tiwa. Tiwa races away. Still Malakai Tiwa working his way. Looking for that one two. Intercepted well by Semi Rokongida. On by Joshua Wasuba trying to get it away. But Bar keep the pressure. Avinash Warren Swami turns and drives. And Avinash Swami with a left foot drive. It's the crossbar underneath the line and slams it in. And in the fifth minute of play, Bar go up by one goal to what a cracker of a goal it was by Avnes Warren Swami. He drove a left foot pile driver, hit the crossbar, hit the line and went in. And nobody's going to say that it didn't cross the line. It definitely crossed the line and into the net it went. Bar go up by one goal to nil. It was coming, as I said, the attack by Bar and Suba tiring because they look slightly unfit. As I said, we've got to sympathize with Suba. They have had only a few players, as Gurjit's been telling uh, the media, the FBC news team. But Bar, a pile driver from Avanes Warren Swami, he looked into the air and thought of his dad. As we pick up play now on his late uh, dad that passed away. And they're going to have a bit more of those shots coming in the second half. Six minutes gone. Bar leading by one goal to nil. The throw in on the broadcast touchline side. In comes at Suba trying to clear it away. And, but in the way Bar, Meli Dondro gets pushed out of the way by Samuel Abula. The referee says play on. They are probably in off season also, but in they come once again. Malakai Tiwa gets brought down by Samuel Abula for the second time. In, in a row that is done an in infringement. <coughs> Kotonga been told to go. And Samuel Agula goes into the yellow card situation. Free kick to uh, the bar side. 
on the broadcast touchline side. And played through long away in the way Simeone, rather in the way Semi Rokongida, but Malakai Tiwa. Then Semi goes across, does enough, plays a short one to Kotonga. Kotonga loses it at Malakai Tiwa. Keeping it close on the broadcast touchline side. They play it back in field. And across the referee gets it. <laughs> a little bit of scrappy play going on there. Again now Marika fouls Jonas Nadeva. Marika knows he's in a yellow card situation. And Kotonga goes across to Meli Dondro. So uh, that's a bit of rough play again as I said. It is now that they've got to lose uh, again those sort of situations coming in here. Let's see what the referee does here. As bar players being told to go away, the linesman there to tell the referee. Kotonga. And let's see what he does. With Meli Dondro, the fourth official there. Kotonga wanting to walk away from it. But he had caused a commotion. Meli Dondro. And Simeone shaking hands. He was never in the picture. And Samuel Kotonga. Referee Atari talking to Kotonga. As I said, in an earlier incident, they shake hands. <coughs> earlier incident, things are getting rough out here, but it's been allowed to play on. And that could be detrimental to this game. But as we say, they are the ones that make the uh, final decision as we pick up to play uh, here. It'll be a super free kick. Simeone Michele. <coughs> <coughs> Apologies for that. And in comes the kick. Rolulu comes out uh, and collects it. As Tony Rolulu drives it high again, no love lost between these two sides here. They play it infield, Kotonga in the way, Abu Zaid intercept, back heels it to Roniel. And play, they flick it through, across it comes, cleared away, Simone Michele was outnumbered. But he did well as Leon Damudamu heads it away. Short back. Bao again trying to regroup Malakai Tiwa. They played across Tony Vesakula, plays a long one, finds Osea Vakatalasau. Vakatalasau cuts it back in field. The clearance by Suba still not good. Into the center circle, Bao play it back into their own territory. Out on towards the broadcast side. Gurjit telling his players to spread out because Ba are using the width. They don't have the markers in there. It's Meli Dondro in again. Osea has come from the right to the left. Lays it back for Takiata. Toes it on for Marika Mandingi. Again, still bar. Takiata, the crowd loving it. Malakai Tiwa. Short. Back to goalkeeper Ralulu. And they're making the super players run around in this heat. Suba game enough to go for it though also. In comes the kick. Headed down by Samuel Avula. Malakai Tiwa in the way. Controls it. Marika Mandingi finding Meli Dondro. Dondro on the broadcast side. In the way, Waisake Nabuningasau. The throw in on the broadcast touchline side. Malakai Tiwa, short. Back again. Tiwa infield, Osea still on the broadcast touchline side. Played through by Marika Mandingi, finding Avanes Swami, finds Malakai Tiwa, lovely play. Infield to Abu Zaid, Zaid across to Tuimasi Akron and playing it through to Malakai Tiwa, tried to curl it away. And out of play it goes for a goal kick. <clears throat> They're building up and as you can see, Gurjit concerned with the the flanks, their flanks uh, that bar are being allowed to come in. They're not closing it down. They're going out in the attack and that's the heat that's taking his toll. And from that far touchline side, they bar clear it away. Back in it comes again. Bar super lose possession to Imasi Manuda. On by Avines Warren Swami again. Avines cuts it back in field. And comes the wild kick by Semi Rokongida. And colliding is to Imasi Manuda with Rangata. And 
It is tired looking passes that is uh, causing this uh, sort of things. And Rangada is okay. <laughs> Just a collision and a warning to Tumasi. As we've gone.